Hi everyone, welcome back to another video and today we're going to be taking a look at It's These, a Mafia in the Morning, the English version, but they've just put out a stage video for this. I know they put out a lyric video yesterday, I've not seen that, I'm, I don't really care for lyric videos, um, but this, this is intriguing, so let's take a look at this. From the look of it, from this stage, it looks like it's filmed probably the same day they did their showcase, so they've had this in the back pocket for a while. Nice one, girls. So, let's take a look at the English version of Mafia in the Morning. And I think I've been right all along by saying this song is a grower. First time listening to it, I was... Mm, but now I'm finding myself coming back to it daily for a listen. There's something really addictive to it now. Like, it's, really, it's an earworm song. It's stuck in your head and you just want to listen to it. So, I knew it all along. Smart boy. Plus we get to see the stage version, which I've not had a video on. I think we've got live vocals as well. Yeah. No true words have ever been spoken there. I love the stage for this song. Like the dance, everything. So far, the English lyrics are decent. That moving floor is tripping me out of it. Oh, we got full on dancers. Just like the MV. Nice. Mafia. Yeah. Like the mafia. I like the little. Attitude Leah's got. Nice, nice, nice. What do we get some at the end? No, 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 no. Overall, honestly, the English lyrics work really well. Some K-pop songs fully don't translate. They translate, but it's they seem a little bit nonsensical and a bit weird. Like the structure's not quite there, and you listen to it and you're like, okay, I get what you're saying, but it just doesn't sound quite right. This works really well. I could quite easily hear this being played on UK radios or American radios because they seem to care more about America than the, the rest of the English speaking world, the ones that invented it over on our tiny island. But no, it works really, really well. Um, I like that. Now, the song is based on the game Mafia, the, the game that the, all K-pop idols play. And if you didn't have a clue about it, anyway and you just thought it was about the Mafia you might not quite understand what they're talking about but it works really really well I, 
I like it. I like it a lot. I think Itzy have done really well with translating their songs into English. None of them sound bad. I think it's mostly because I, I get and I, I know the Korean songs more. So hearing them in English at first is a little bit like, Ooh, what, 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 what is this? But now they're on, I've got them in my car on my playlist and I listen to them from time to time. They'll just pop in and I don't skip them. I'll, I'll, I'll listen to them and I do think Itzy have done a really good job translating into English. I don't know if they've got the same people who translate like Twice do because some of their songs felt a bit wonky where Itzy's have been really cool. And this one I think is probably one of the top ones. It, everything translates really well. I know I've said it eight times but I'm just impressed by that. Stage performance, fantastic. Exactly what you'd expect from Itzy. I've seen a couple of the stages from some of the shows but I never do a video on them because they just get flagged and I get warnings and I, I just rather not touch that kind of stuff now and again. So it's nice to do a video on the stage. Dancing's brilliant. The girl's attitude is really cool. Like they, they give off a really domineering and sort of bad girl attitude, even though we all know they're just a big bunch of softies. So really, really, really cool. I hope you all enjoyed it. Let me know your thoughts below. So for me, I'd quite, I'd really love to see them tour in England and or Europe or America but in England because I'll probably get a chance to see this and I hope by them doing some of these English songs it means we might get that chance to see them but part of me just thinks if I see them live I'd like to hear the Korean versions <laughs> I don't know I don't know if it's just me just because that, that's that's the initial first time you hear the song but I'd, I'd, I'd love to see them come over here. It seems like the, the girl's English pronunciation is fantastic. Their speaking is brilliant, like the, the Hello82 stuff they do with, with the little kids. Um, they're fantastic. They can communicate and get along really well in English, and it just makes me feel like, are they going to come over? Are they going to come over? I don't know. I know it's not just me that wants them here, but I just, it's such a slim chance they'll ever come to England. But thanks for watching. Like, share, subscribe, do all that stuff for the algorithms, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.